You all are most welcome on our YouTube channel Sawal Bawal. Our question is if x plus 1 by x is equal to minus 1, then we have to find the value of x to the power 2024 plus 1 upon x to the power 2024. Before I start to solve this question, please subscribe our channel and press the bell icon. You can also follow us on Telegram, WhatsApp and Twitter which is now known as X. If you have any query or questions, then you can mail us at sawalbawal at the rate of gmail.com. Now let us start to solve this question. It is given that x plus 1 by x is equal to minus 1 and we have to find the value of x to the power 2024 plus 1 upon x to the power 2024. To solve this, solve this, we need to simplify this given equation. We can write it as x square plus 1 upon x is equal to minus 1. Further, we can write it as x plus 1 is equal to minus x that can be written as x square plus x plus 1 is equal to 0. If we will compare it with the standard quadratic equation that is x square bx plus c is equal to 0, then the value of a is equal to 1, value of b is equal to 1 and the value of c is also equal to 1. Since we, we are interested in calculating its root, therefore we need to know the value of discriminant since the value of discriminant tells that whether the root of given equation is real or not. Let us calculate its the value of d that is the discriminant. Then the value of b is equal to 1, 1 square minus 4 into 1 into 1 and that is equal to minus 3. It tells that the value of d is less than 0 means it has no real root. It means it has no real root. It means it will have the complex root. To know the value of complex root, first we should know the value of iota. Iota is actually under root minus 1 and iota square is equal to minus 1. Iota to the power 3 is equal to iota and that can be written as iota square and therefore we can write it as minus iota and iota to the power 4 that is equal to plus 1. These are the properties which we will use in calculating the complex root. Therefore, we should remember it. Now we need to calculate the complex root of this given quadratic equation. We will calculate it with the help of formula minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac by 2a. The value of b is 1 therefore we will put it here minus 1 plus minus under root 1 square minus 4 into 1 into 1 divided by 2 that is equal to minus 1 plus minus under root minus 3 divided by 2. Therefore, we can write it as minus 1 plus minus under root 3 and we can write it as under root minus 1 divided by 2 that is equal to x. And this under root minus 1 can be written as iota for the calculation of complex root. Therefore, we will write it minus 1 plus minus under root 3 iota by 2. This is the complex root of the given quadratic equation. It is a 2 root. Let, let, us, calc uh, let us call 1 root at, as omega that is minus 1 plus under root 3 iota by 2 and let us call another root omega square that is equal to minus 1 minus under root 3i by 2. 
Why we are calling it as omega square? It is a very interesting property. If you will square this one, then this will be equal to this one. Let us solve it. Let us prove it. Omega is equal to minus 1 plus under root 3 iota by 2. If we are going to, uh, if you will square it, then it must be equal to this value. Then, then and then only we can call, call it as omega square. Just we are going to square it. Square of 2 is 4. A square, uh, we are uh, solving it by the property of a plus b to the uh, a plus b to the whole power 2 that is equal to minus 1 square plus root under 3 iota square plus 2 into minus 1 under root 3 iota. A square of minus 1 is equal to 1 plus a square of under root 3 is 3 and a square of iota we have already told, told you uh, that square of iota is equal to minus 1 therefore this is equal to minus 1 plus 2 into minus 1 is minus 2 into root 3 iota by 2 sorry 4. Further we can write it as 1 minus 3 minus 2 root under 3 iota by 4 that is equal to minus 2 minus 2 under root 3 iota by 4 and this can be written as minus 1 minus root 3 iota by 2 and this is equal to another root of this quadratic equation. That is why we are calling this as omega square. Now from the quadratic equation, given quadratic equation that is the x square plus x plus 1 is equal to 0, we can say that it has a 2 root omega and omega square. Let us see its another property. If there is a quadratic equation x square bx plus c is equal to 0 and if it has a 2 root, let it is the alpha and beta then sum of root is written as minus b by a and the product of root is written as c by a. With the help of this formula, we can write it write as omega plus omega square is equal to minus b by a that is equal to minus 1 and that is equal to omega plus omega square is equal to minus 1 and further we can write omega plus omega square plus 1 is equal to 0 and this is our first required properties that is equal to minus 1. If you write with this help of this formula that alpha into beta that is equal to omega into omega square that will be equal to 1 that is omega cube will be equal to 1. This is another required property for solving x to the power 2024 plus 1 upon x to the power 2024. Now we can easily calculate the value of x to the power 2024 plus 1 upon x to the power 2024. As we have already found that the value of x can either be omega or omega square. Let us put the value of x as omega. Then we can then we will write it as omega to the power 2024 plus 1 upon omega to the power 2024. 2024 can be written as 3 into 674 plus 2. Therefore, we will write it as omega to the power 3 into 674 plus 2 plus 1 upon omega to the power 3 into 674 plus 2 and we know the exponent rule that if there is a power x to the power m plus n then we write it as x to the power m into x to the power n. With the help of this formula we can write it as omega to the power cube into 674 
into omega square plus 1 upon omega to the power 3 into 674 into omega square and we have already derived that omega cube is equal to 1 omega cube is equal to 1 with the help of this formula we can say that omega cube into 674 plus into omega square plus 1 upon omega cube to the power 674 into omega square and with help of this formula omega cube is equal to 1 we can write it as a 1 and we can write this one also equal to 1 therefore this will be equal to 1 to the power 674 into omega square plus 1 upon 1 to the power 674 into omega square and we can write it as omega square plus 1 upon omega square taking LCM we can write as omega square omega to the power 4 plus 1 omega once again we will apply omega cube into omega plus 1 upon omega square and further we can write as omega q is equal to 1 1 into omega plus 1 upon omega square and we have already derived that 1 plus omega plus omega square is equal to 0 with the help of this formula we can write 1 plus omega is equal to minus of omega square therefore 1 plus omega upon omega square can be written as minus of omega square by omega square and cancelling omega square with omega square this will be equal to minus 1 therefore we can say that x to the power 2024 plus 1 upon x to the power 2024 is equal to minus 1 this is our required solution thanks for watching this video please subscribe our channel to support us and don't forget to like comment and share thanks once again